Okay, so this is our supine clam exercise. At the sideline, regular clam shell or the hip abduction exercises are a little too much for the uh, for the muscle group, usually some of the outside hip pain or uh, posterior butt pain. Uh, we'll start it on the back, and we'll use a band to give us a little resistance to that abduction external rotation movement. So, we're just gonna run a band underneath the thighs, like so. And when we grab onto it, we're gonna have the arms kind of go out like so, kind of that same abduction external rotation movement, kind of spreading the chest and getting the shoulder blades into the ground as we grab a little bit of core. So when we're here, we can do that little push out to the side each way. When it goes across the thighs here, we don't get quite as much resistance and has a tendency to roll up. So I like to kind of loop it across the knee each way so we get that little crisscross. So when I come out like so, that's trying to collapse my knees in. So I have to first resist against it just to keep them neutral. And then I do that little push out to the side each way as I hold that. So we can either do this as like a rep, like arms out, one each way, or both, or just and they come back and forth each time or just maintain and just do like a set of 10 on each side. If we have trouble feeling this, we can also pick the toes up in the air to almost like form an arch in the air. So like toes up, almost like a, little, a slight turn in to start that, help that outward spiral, sort of that outward spiral of the thigh that we're going for. So when we do that, we go across, that'll give us a little bit more, especially if you're having some hip flexors some hamstring tension, as you're going either way. So once again, this is the uh, supine flame show exercise with a band for whenever we need a little, little less resistance, but still need some work into our outside hip. So.